YouTube. Today I'm going to be showing you how to use your old Xbox 360 hard drive for the for your Xbox 360 Slim. Uh, now what you're going to need for this uh, project is a hard drive from the Xbox 360, the old version, a flat head screwdriver, or maybe a scissor, and you're going to need a uh, I'm not sure what to call this, but it's like a hexagon-ish star screwdriver. Uh, maybe you can find it in your garage or something. So what you want to start to do with is uh, I already unscrewed all the screws. You want to do that, and over here is there's going to be a little sticker that says Microsoft. You just want to peel that off, and there'll be screw. So once you unscrew all these screws. Keep it in one place so you don't lose it, just in case. And now, you want to loosen the front. And you're going to see your hard drive right there. Slowly loosen the sides. And then here is where your flat head screw and your scissor comes in. If you don't have one of these, you can use your scissor, but I'm going to use this. So I'm just going to put in my screw driver and just... You want to get inside and just slowly ply it out. Don't do it with too much force because you don't want to holding the brake, your hard drive to break. You see? It clicks off, so. Yeah. Alright. Once you've got them both clicked off, you can carefully remove to the hard drive. Alright. Again, you might want to keep all the pieces just in case you want to put it back or something. So now you have your hard drive itself. Now you want to remove it from this plastic thing, gray plastic. So you're gonna need the same exact star screw, except you're gonna need a bigger version or model. So you want to just take the black screws out over here. You want to unscrew them. Again, keep it in one place. You do not want to lose them. Alright, that one's a little tight. You'll notice it starts to come very loose, but be careful. And uh, try not to scratch the board inside because you might lose the memory. Alright, once you got that, you want to remove this metal plate right here. And then carefully and gently, gently take this part of the board, push it up, and slowly push it. Glide it and slide it out, attempting not to scratch anything. Uh, and also you want to, this part over here, you want to pop it out, so it pops out here, and then you want to continue sliding it out until everything comes apart, and then here you want to just rip it off. Alright, here's your hard drive itself. You have a hard drive. And here it is. This is the finished project. Uh, the hard drive itself. So you don't need anything else if you're planning just to keep it this way. All right. Now, okay, so now what you want to do is you could either, two ways you could do this. You could either just plug it in to your Xbox, but um, it's not supported and it's going to be wobbly, so it might crack off. I suggest... I'm going to put a link below where you could buy a, a shell, the Xbox 360 Slim shell from Amazon. So you could just place this in and plug it in. It's not cheap, it's about, I think, 6 or 10 bucks. I'm not sure. So I'm going to post a link. You could go two ways. Uh, if you want to take the risk and just plug it in and see if it works, that's okay. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it.
that is uh, my thing. Comment, rate, subscribe, and that's it. I uh, hope this video helps.